Only on WRAL, frustration and shock. A business owner upset after someone fired shots at his store with customers inside. Thank you for joining us. I'm Gerald Owens. And I'm Deborah Morgan. Raleigh police are working to find out what led to a late night shooting in downtown near Martin Street. You can see the damage here. WRAL's Aaron Thomas spoke with the owner of Rochambeau Beverage Company, the local business caught in the crossfire. Aaron. Yeah, Deborah, I can tell you from the outside looking in, there's a steady a stream of people that are inside supporting this local business, not letting this scary situation get to them. It was a bartender who said that he saw shots coming out of a vehicle headed in this direction. It appeared those gunshots were trying to hear hit two young people in the area. This business happened uh, to be hit by one of those stray bullets. That's why you see some of those windows boarded up tonight. The owner says he's frustrated knowing this happened with 10 customers inside. I got a phone call from my bartender, and my bartender said, hey, place has been shot. A frightening call no business owner wants to receive. Jimmy Fletch says he and his wife opened Rochambeau Beverage Company, where customers can enjoy a drink and wind down with games. So we just wanted to create a space where there's stuff to do. But danger hit too close to home when multiple gunshots were fired downtown Monday night. One of those bullets hit the store with people inside. It's very, very frustrating, especially in the sense that we're open. We had customers here. The bullet went underneath the pinball machines went down this way underneath all the pinball machines, skipped off the ground right there, and actually ended up landing right here. It's just sad. Sad for Ethan Overman to imagine the innocent lives put at risk at his favorite hangout spot. You don't wanna have to worry about a bullet coming through the window like that. I mean, everybody was just in here enjoying themselves from every, everything I heard. I mean, wasn't anything anyone here did. Fleck describes Rochambeau as a place for people to enjoy themselves. He hopes the downtown shooting doesn't ruin its reputation. Now, I definitely don't want it to affect our patrons in any way. I don't want anyone to feel like they're in danger no matter where they're at. Now the good news out of all of this is that no one was hurt uh, by this bullet coming in the business. Raleigh police officers have not taken any suspects into custody. As for this damage you see with this boarded window, uh, Jimmy Flex says he estimates this will cost him a couple thousand dollars to repair, but he has called his insurance company. Deborah, Aaron Thomas live in Raleigh. Thanks, Aaron.